Hey, what's up guys? This is Justin from My Round Robin. Your last social media task for today will be to jump on Twitter. So go ahead and log in your Twitter account. You can see I'm at the My Round Robin Twitter account. Um, and from here, what, you, what we're going to do today is we're going to compose a new tweet. We're going to compose a new tweet and we're going to add an image. I'm going to add an image that I uploaded to Facebook before. That's okay though, because I'm not linking them together, so there won't be a repetitive same picture on uh, same exact post. I'm going to give it a little bit different text um, than the Facebook post we used with this image. I simply have an image of a girl with online marketing and saying that we give guaranteed success, because we do. Um, the SEO task that Josh gives you and the SEO, uh, the social media task that I give you. Uh, they are guaranteed to drive up more fans, more traffic to your website, and for you to have your brand to have a better presence online. We guarantee that. Um, so what we're going to do is I'm going to add this here, and I'm going to say, um, check us out if you haven't already. We're the new marketing bird on the block. Oh, spell bird wrong bird on the block and then I'm gonna hashtag SEO I'm gonna hashtag small biz and then I'm gonna go ahead and tweet that you can also do location based tweets too so all I do is click here to upload the image let me tweet that off and I'm gonna make you do one other thing while you're here on Twitter I'm gonna make you retweet someone so the best people to retweet are you know people that either are in your industry who you like a lot um, there's a very good article that just came out with some for from you know a reputable place like Forbes um, whatever it may be whether it's your latest blog post go over to your website and grab go to your latest blog post do a, a highlight of that right click copy and paste that in there um, but right now let's concentrate on retweets. Retweeting is a great way to get people to follow you and to check out your page. Um, hopefully people will start retweeting you if your tweets are high quality. We're going to go and search, um, we're going to search Google real quick because that's who we deal with a lot of the time. Um, we'll go through and you can see these are all the results for Google. And let's see. Oh, this is a, um, a great article from Google themselves. See, this guy is linking out a tweet. Get a never-before-seen look at the inside of a Google data center, which is awesome. It's a really cool article. I'm going to open that link in a new tab to check it out real quick. Always look at the um, links that are associated with things you retweet. You don't want to retweet, you know, something about one of your competitors or something negative that may, you know, hurt your brand. So this is a cool website that Google just released saying this is how Google runs and this is how we do things behind uh, our high-tech data centers. So cool, really cool. It seems like it's a good tweet. It's been retweeted quite a lot, but you know what? I'm going to be one of those guys and retweet it real quick. That's all I did. I pressed retweet, retweet again. If you go over to the My Round Robin homepage here, click again right here. And you'll see this is retweeted by My Round Robin. And it's that person's tweet. You can also tell by this little green symbol it's a retweet. And there's the one I made just a moment ago. So go ahead and make a, make a tweet, a regular tweet, hopefully with some hashtags, hopefully with an image or a link. And then retweet an industry leader or something relative to your industry. And that's going to be the last social media task for the day. Thank you and enjoy.